he gets Fox off stage, much like everybody else, is going to eat him alive. But the biggest part is it's on ledge. So all of those rising forwarders that Light loves to do, which hit everyone, are not as free on ledge against this character. So it's gonna be on uh it's gonna be on Sharp to establish that and put some fear in him. Otherwise he's gonna just get away for that for free every time. Literally just had the conversation with Hazmat Rules at Collision last weekend about this matchup specifically. Mm -hmm. More uh, as a control case, like, this is one of those matchups where I, if you ask a Fox main, they'll say Wolf wins. If you ask a Wolf main, they'll probably say Fox wins. That's how you know it's an even matchup. Yeah, <laughs> like, I, I remember very specifically from Light, he said that he asked Zachary about it. They yeah. both agreed that it was even, but they were both kind of doing that. They're like, uh, Wolf wins. No, Fox wins. Like, no, Fox wins there because he yeah. just gets up and up smashes. <laughs> right, right. It's like, oh, but Wolf down smash at the last, you know, it's basically saying like, yeah, it's even, but there's one aspect of this I hate. And Wolf is going to hate getting absolutely mixed, and Fox is going to hate getting down smashed the ledge. Yeah. Another thing Wolf doesn't like that much is that normally his Nair, that one right there, right. beats so many people in Nooch, because you can't challenge him yep. air to air. Problem is, Fox doesn't care that much because he could wait for you to do it and then punish you with a dash attack. Yeah. So you're taking so much just for that. And we're seeing a lot of that coming in from like He's smothering him hey. to make sure he doesn't get it. Jab lock, up smash, and he goes up three stocks to one. All right, so what were those other characters you were talking about? Uh, so Sephiroth, TSS, uh -huh. Joker, yeah, Lucina. I don't think it's, don't think it's going to be the wolf, but we'll see. <laughs> even in, <laughs> trying to even it back up <laughs> with that back air, but still two stocks to one, and light just looks so in control in this situation. It's tough, man. It's tough. That yep. air, so good. I know recently when they played, I think the ZSS did come out, and... It kind of went how we expected, but right, it, it right. looks solid, so it could possibly come up here. I think after this first game, we might see the Wolf at least one more, because the Wolf still can get warmed up. We just haven't seen it much of late. But Light is playing immaculate on defense. Does get thrown, though, and gets the roll in, knowing that at most, it, even if he takes up smash there, he doesn't die yet. Right, right. Hey, that was pretty, pretty crazy option. f kill from Light. Oh, I, dude, I've seen so many of those forward air clips from Light. Mm -hmm. I'm tr trying to make it work, but... He's going to eventually make it work. I'm saying, And yeah. a lot of people are not going to be happy about it. I mean, we will, but oh, yes. everybody else not so much. Oh, Good patience. He knew that he wanted to up smash bad, yeah. but he's like, I, you got, you have to commit to coming to me now for this KO. All right, nice use. Just extending it with that dash tag. Not going for the up smash quite yet. Forward throw here. Oh, down throw. Same thing. <laughs> I got... I get why, because yeah. it, like, he put himself in a position where if he did jump, he just jumps back again, gets in the air, boom, you're dead. So after that, maybe forward throw to catch him on the ledge, but that's that comes good through. Stuff, good stuff. One thing, uh, I was also talking to Hazmat Rule, smart individual and a talker. <laughs> the back airs that Light tries to, okay, that was sick. The back airs that Light tries to do on ledge, are, I think are something, like they're a sign of the time. I think eventually, and we saw it a little bit in his set with Chag, Chag and Collision, and we just saw the littlest glimpse of it here in this situation, but I think it is something that players will eventually adapt to mm. by parrying that second back air. And we just saw it here. Sharp had an amazing turnaround and almost made it work, but not quite. But it's definitely something like, oh, sh oh he killed him at rate of 420. Oh, my God. That was such a good... That, that, that was such good spacing. Like, he put himself in a spot where he, like, he faded on the shield and made it look enticing enough right. to grab, but... Everybody gets cooked by that. Yep. <laughs> you you would have thought you were getting that grab. Not today. That's the, the part of the N1 mixtape where you're like, yeah, I would have got I would have got that. No, yep, that's me on the floor right yeah, there yeah, for okay, sure. Uh -huh. okay, stupid. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It is going to be the Wolf, though. I, admittedly, kind of putting it together at the end of that last game, but it might just be too little too late. The biggest thing is that Wolf all, is always hitting on last stock, right? Because you can get one of those early gifts and right. get back into it, especially either down air, F tilt or something. But you got to get the hits first. His double jump is gone. That Nair was in a good spot, but he did not get the connection he was looking for to Kipsy did that ledge trap. Big forward air here, too. Knocking light back off stage, but makes it right back on with a neutral air. Let's see what the play is here. Forward air. Falls. Oh, my goodness. So good. Anti-air up smash. It's a kill move, and then it's anti-air. Like, does everything you want in that situation. Good stuff from light. That puts it in your head that you can't swing out a disadvantage, yep. too, because he's been trying to nair to get out of these. Right. He's just burying it in his mind. No. And that's going to allow him to get those jump read up air so much more as the set goes on. All right. Forward air. Going to open up the neutral. Okay. Big combo opportunity from light, but good jump out from Sharp. And Sharp getting hit by the late hit of up tilt, so you got to take a solid like 40-ish just for one mistake there, light covering ledge as much as possible. That, I'm surprised, even found its mark I'm because saying. light was waiting and he still got hit by that nair. All right, there is the forward throw. Still just holding down the stage here. It's tough for Sharp. You just, okay, dash tag, not exactly what I was expecting, but 
you kind of have a, a pretty tall order to get back to stage against Fox. So what are you going to do, jump in with an aerial? Bro, he's ready for that. I mean, look, sometimes you, know? you got to hit him with, like, the side of the hey. team, bro. Oh, speaking of which, catching him and then immediately taunting after, get into his head, let him know that I'm the dominant one here. And late. That, that, oh, wait, is your double jump gone? Yeah. Okay, that was... Okay, okay maybe on. that wasn't the best thing. They no, could have taken. no, definitely uh, not. Like, one of them was death, but the other one okay. was just, like, extended death. He's <laughs> just getting that damage on. That's sad if you're sharp, too, because it's like, wait, you took my thing. I'm supposed to edge guard you. You can't, you can't do that to me. Like, Ooh. oh, hold on, though. That back air is huge. Love the shines. They've been so good from late. Hey, Catches right. him below the ledge. Down smash, only 68% on sharp. One stock apiece. But he does catch him with the jump with the down air. His double jump is gone, but he gets himself over to the side. Tom Sharp, I'm trying to find center stage and box as much as possible yes. because you were talking about it. Light's ledge trapping has been immaculate, so yes. you want nothing to do with here. Speaking of which, he's taking so much damage. Interesting idea, the shield there. How many Tomahawks? How many j j empty hop shield grabs are you going to get caught by? Finally tries to mix it up. The roll in. I get it. He really, I, I like, get he really it. hit him with the, you won't believe I'm neutral get up again. Yeah, yeah. Four times in a row. It's like, no, I believe because I'm reacting to them hey, every time. the tech chase. Had to make it look nice for the fans. And the immediate taunt. Shaking it off. Sleeves still all the way down. He got to wake up because we, we out here at the casino. I know that he's not going to prop. He's going to be here till like 4 o'clock hey, in the morning. He is. I remember last game, Recon, I had to leave pretty early. And then uh, he was he texted me like afterwards like yo are you here and I was like bro it's like look at shit yo, yo the, like, the hair movement it's like two thirty and he's like oh I thought you were gonna come gamble I was like I did <laughs> till like midnight I got at work <laughs> yeah like I, originally I was gonna ride down with them all right, and right. then they reminded me that they're probably gonna be staying he was nah, like mm, it's gamer I got time. nothing to do tomorrow then I thought about it, I was like if I stay here my tomorrow's gone <laughs> yeah <laughs> but. <laughs> Gamers Gone lives on, of course. We're currently in winner's semis. The other side of the uh, attempt to punch the ticket in the winner's finals currently looking a lot like it's going to be light as we see the switch up here to, to Joker. And it's going to be the FD as well. This is actually a pretty common counter pick that uh, Sharp will go for when it's Joker. I feel like he just likes the fact that nobody can escape his jungle pressure okay. on this stage. I like it. I like it. Definitely a good idea. I'm, I'm a big fan. We saw it like with some players in Smash 4, definitely some players in, in Ultimate. But having a sort of character and stage combo package to give your opponent is definitely something that they'll always have to think about. Uh, one thing you don't Where have to think about is the auto combo. Where'd the percentage come from? AJ, right? where did that fair even connect? I could have sworn I saw the back air come out from, from like nah, Joker first. Nah, we were watching different games. Actually, still gets the combo off. Uh, gets the counter off, rather, to break up the combo. And Light trying to put the pressure on. Still somehow finding all of these extensions, even with Arsa and Hello. This oh, he's taking crazy. so much damage for it, too. Like, this is your this is your opportunity to get back in the game, and it's disappearing rapidly. Right. Okay. Going to side beat the ledge. Uh, side beat the forward area is what I meant to say. Yeah, you, you, you were right. You're, you're building up to it. And right. that was at the very end of Arsa, too. Yeah. It, even... No, even without Ar Arsen. If he had no Arsen, he, he, was, he was not dying to that. No. But somebody's going to lad that later and prove me wrong. Right, right. And whoever it does it, you're mean. But 98% <laughs> already. 105 hey. and a fresh up smash. Going to go ahead and send a packet. Two stocks up to one. Sharp with the late counter pick to Joker. It's been looking solid, but not enough. And it's looking like Light is going to be like finding his way there. If Sharp doesn't get a big like Arsen down air soon. Yeah, I think... What we're seeing here is a little bit of a, we had a sort of sandwich of sets, a 3-0 of game five, and we might be getting another 3-0 after a game five. Fight is just so, he's just so good at this, man. He's like, great. Th he's this good. is, the, the, the fear he's establishing while yeah. Sharp has Arsene is absurd, because usually you're the one who's trying to find, like, a good poke as he gets in air to air and air, and he's going to take it out 3-0 fashion over Sharp and move forward. He just made Arsene look like it didn't exist at all. Just the invalidation of that yeah. is key to this matchup, and he did it dominantly. He said, bring your friend. I do not care. I will up smash <laughs> Yo, you. I, I will, I will I throw will. hands with you and your boy. Yeah. I don't care. You and who? I do not care. Nair still connects in the up smash, even if your boy's watching. And honestly, boy over there like, bro, why'd you invite me? Hey, like, why'd you yeah, tell me to whoa. come here? I don't know. <laughs> do I don't you know see him, him? Bro. I don't know him. Bro, that is... That is a walking fox <laughs> with steel toe boots, cybernetic legs, and a gun. Why am I here? Nah, bro, that's, that's not you. That's... But one thing I like to talk about uh, when I see light play, I've seen plenty of matches of light, obviously. You have two. Is he He has this play style. I think a lot of it, it's hard to appreciate 
You don't understand. I won't say you don't. A lot of people don't understand. Well, I, yeah, we, we don't. <laughs> not, uh, not even like a specific viewer either, but a lot of people don't understand the amount of like pressure and conditioning he's doing. He makes some really good players look really dumb because yep. you don't understand like how like little tiny details, how many jumps he's mixing up, the aerial timing he's mixing up, like the footstools on the shield that he implements. You don't even know. It may just look like jumping. Yeah, you know, some people at home. Like. That's why I applaud how well Tweak fought against him oh, at yeah, Tweak, like Collision him up, because in the past, like I, I mean, you ask a lot of top players in general, they.